Book 1. Chapter 1. The Chi, Refining Ancestor. You are listening at FameTV.info. Book 1. Chapter 1. The Chi, Refining Ancestor in the vast land of Gu Province, a world of mortal realm, there was the Qingming Sword Sect, one of the largest sects in this world that I in this heaven and earth, the reputation of this sect was known to everyone. In this sect, not only every hundred of years, there would be a group of cultivator who reached deity transformation, physique integration or even heavenly tribulating stage, but also that more than three thousand years ago, there was a sect leader who broke through the heavenly tribulation and ascended to the immortal realm perhaps because of this. This ancient sect has survived several calamities for thousands of years and still stood, this year, it was the Qingming Sword Sect's disciple election which was held every twenty years. People from several countries, who were eager to find the path of immortality, gathered in the Hanging Sword Town under the Qingming Mountain, but that night, a catastrophe quietly came to Qingming Sword Sect before they knew it that I and the night, two third dot generation disciples were yawning boringly, talking about the latest martial art trivia and beautiful teachers and sisters. By the way, they thought about tomorrow's disciple election ceremony, wondered whether they would meet their fated one among new disciples, but when they talked, a cloud of darkness quietly covered the Qingming sword sect, and silently clouded the bright moon. The first thing that struck was a strong sense of oppression, which made them felt like they were suffocating. And these disciples guarding the mountain gate almost felt the strangeness and anxiety almost instantly, afterward, outside the protection array which covered the Qingming mountain, the dark clouds filled the sky, and there were thunder snakes rolling in the dark clouds. During which a voice echoed as a thunderous rumbling sounded bold Qing Ming. I come to revenge. The rumble of thunder was louder, the thunderbolt exploded, and the thunder snakes in the dark clouds gathered together and turned into a large thunder lance. It slammed onto the protection array of the Qing Ming sect, causing a violent shaking, hurry up and report to the sect leader. The disciples fell to the ground with this violent tremor, but a second dot generation disciple quickly reacted, hurriedly got up from the ground, shouted at the other disciples, and then rushed to the alarming bell. He used his fist like a hammer, hit the bell, made it ringing loudly, the array engraved on alarming bell made its sound echoed to all the Qingming mountain. At this moment, everyone in the Qingming sword sect heard this sound, and the second generation of disciples quickly commanded their junior brothers and sisters, and younger generations to take refuge. The first dot generation disciples drove their respective flying swords, followed the elders and the leader to rise into the sky. For a time, countless swords flying on the top of Qingming Mountain shuttled through, which was a beautiful scene, but the uninvited guest apparently did not have the patience to wait for the arrival of the sect leader and the elders. Seeing that the thunder lance was unbroken, the rolling black clouds under its control suddenly turned into a beast paw that covered the sky, and it suddenly swung toward Qingming Sword Sect. With a crisp sound, the protection array, which stood and protected Qingming Sword Sect for thousands of years, was crushed by the giant cloud claws like a soap bubble, the giant claws continued unabated and made a loud noise. From the mountain gate to the main hall, along with the whole mountain road, all of which were ruined that IT was also at this time that a cyan sword light came directly from the cloud and turned into a cyan flying sword, which suddenly slammed in front of the giant cloud claw that a figure soared from the highest main peak of the Qingming mountain and turned into a handsome figure in a white robe, standing in the air, watching the dark clouds and coldly said, Who is coming? Ignorant Junior. Haven't you heard of this thunder demonic venerable's reputation? The dark clouds kept rolling, seeming to be brewing with anger, today I came to settle the odds with old Qing Ming. Get him out. Our founder, Qing Ming ancestor, had already ascended three thousand years ago. The sect leader, Zhu Yunzi frowned, if you are looking for him, you should go to the immortal realm, not to invade our Qing Ming sword sect. Ha 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 ha. A laugh sounded from among the clouds, funny, ridiculous. Even that damned old Qing Ming can ascend. Okay, you are his disciples, so today I will destroy your sect, then I will seek revenge in the immortal realm, the dark clouds dispersed, and among the thunderclouds, a huge and immortal beast appeared, which had a wolf head and a horse body, followed by three hook. 
shaped long tails, entangled in black sullen thunder, sure enough, it was the thunder beast sealed by the ancestor three thousand years ago, seeing its true body, Ju Yunzi frowned, this thunder beast had the bloodline of a legendary beast in the immortal realm. It originally had the strength equivalent to the physique integration stage. After falling into the demonic path, its strength has soared. Now it could almost rival cultivators in the great ascension stage. He was very confident, but he also knew that he could not be the opponent of this thunder beast. The one who had the highest rank in the sect was the great elder, but he was currently in closed dot door cultivation. Once he was disturbed, not mention his lifespan would be affected, his chi essence would recoil and seriously injured him, which wouldn't help this case. Thinking of this, Ju Yunzi's thoughts moved and contacted one of his close disciples, go to Seven Stars Peak and ask Uncle Ancestor to come and help. A disciple in red clothing, driving a flying sword, swiping behind the elders, passed on the disciple's words and quickly took the lead. Then he turned into a streamer and flew to the most remote peak of the Qingming Mountain, seeing his disciple flying away, Zhu Yunzi relaxed a little, then he raised his fingers, and the blue flying sword under his feet turned into a stream of rainbow flying around him, want to destroy the Qingming sword sect. Then I, Zhu Yunzi, can only compete with you Thunder Demonic Venerable for a while. While Qingming's leader Zhu Yunzi stopped Thunder Demonic Venerable, the disciple in red clothing also drove the flying sword and quickly came to the seven stars peak that I in a hurry, he didn't have time to show etiquette, walking up the mountain from the mountain road, but fell directly into the small courtyard near the top of the mountain. As soon as he landed, he knelt directly on one knee and shouted. Qing Ming sword sect was attacked, and the sect lender sent this disciple to ask the uncle. Ancestor to come out to the rescue. The sound echoed and rang through the whole mountain. After a moment, the door of a room in the yard was pushed open, and a lazy voice came out, I know. The sound of the steps sounded, and then a figure appeared in front of the disciple. He couldn't help his curiosity, looked up, and saw a handsome young man standing in front of himself. That man's skin was smooth like a baby, but he had white hair and white eyebrows like a hundred-dot-year-dot-old man that he showed a lazy face, and he wasn't wearing any clothing representing the Qingming sect. Instead, he was wearing a tight dot fitting cloth robe, stepping on a pair of cloud shoes under his feet, and an iron sword hung on his waist, which did not look like a cultivator but more like a warrior but what shocked the disciple the most was the cultivation rank of the legendary uncle ancestor, dot chi refining stage, the disciple in red clothes was startled, this was a level of power that could be reached by almost everyone, including martial artists under the mountain. With the strength of the Thunder Demonic Venerable, let alone a Qi refining rookie, even if a nascent soul cultivator could only become its food, it's over, today is the doomsday for Qingming sect, the disciple in red muttered uncontrollably where is Zhu Yunzi now. The white dot haired young man approached the disciple in red and asked him. But the disciple was clearly in an abnormal state, muttering some weird words, hu hu hu, we are already dead, what the hell are you talking about? Have you been invaded by demon hearts? The uncle ancestor, in the chi refining stage, carrying his iron sword, came to the disciple, frowned and asked, Hey, I'm asking you. Where is Ju Yunzi? Is he on the main peak? No more, no more. The disciple in red showed that giving up expression on his face, raised his finger and pointed in the direction of the mountain gate. The sect leader is fighting with the demon in front of the mountain gate. Oh, I see. The white dot haired and white dot browed uncle ancestor nodded, and then squatted slightly, and the disciple in red clothes suddenly felt like he was in a terrifying storm, there was a loud bang, the whole seven stars peak was shaken, the ground at his foot was broken. The disciples in red clothes were unstable and fell on his butts, looking at the figure of the uncle ancestor, who had already flown high into the clouds and jumped in the direction of the mountain gate that at the gate of Qingming sword sect, the disciples and elders looked up at the sky, seeing their leader fought with the invader in the clouds that I in the sky, the lightning snake and sword shuttled endlessly, surging with huge energy, even a bit of energy leaked out in the meantime could easily blow. Up a small hill, a h. A few minutes later, 
a muffled noise suddenly heard in the clouds that a white figure fell from the clouds and hit the bell in front of the mountain gate, making a loud noise, the dust dispersed, and Zhu Yunzi slowly stood up from the ground, holding his fate sword, blood came out from his mouth. He looked up at the sky with a solemn look, ha ha ha, thousands of years later, Qing Ming's successors are nothing. With the thunder and lightning, thunder demonic venerable descended from the sky, staring at Zhu Yunzi on the ground with the posture of a winner, you have been defeated. Old Qing Ming's sect is ruined here today. It raised its head, and a thunder light was emitted from the spiral unicorn on top of it, communicating with the thundercloud, brewing extremely terrible moves but at this moment, a figure fell suddenly in the sky and kicked the thunder beast, boom, the thunder beast was caught off guard and flew upside down, landed on a small hill bag outside Qingming Mountain, and crashed the whole mountain, who? It roared angrily, rushing out of the dust, but saw a young man with white eyebrows and white hair, standing in front of Zhu Yunzi, looking at it with all his heart, my name is Bai Chiron. The man smiled gently and said, today, on behalf of my teacher Qingming Taoist, I will kill you. The thunder beast stared at the man carefully for a moment, then suddenly burst into laugh, ha 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 ha. What are you talking about? This is the funniest joke I have ever heard in my life. Thunder beast pointed at Bai Chiron with his forefoot, and his tears and snot came out with a smile, a chi refining rookie dares to claim to be an apprentice of old Qin Ming. Ha, huh, your insult to him is far beyond my imagination. Laughter gradually converged, and Thunder Beast said lowly, go away and I can let you go. That won't work. Bai Chiron smiled, but his forehead was cramped, do you have any problem with the Qi refining cultivators? What? Thunder Beast did not want to answer this boring question. When he saw Bai Chiron, he opened his mouth and sprayed out a thunder, trying to smash Bai Chiron along with Zhu Yunzi, the main goal of this thunderbolt was still Zhu Yunzi. In its thought, a small ant in the Qi refining stage didn't worth for it to pay attention, it could erase countless ants like this with a sneeze, sect leader. Seeing the thunder beast's attack, the disciples screamed, but Zhu Yunzi was calm, because he saw that Bai Chiron in front of himself had pulled out his sword, his Qi came out like the sea, lifted from Bai Chiron's Dantian, ignited his sword blade, covered his sword in a burning flame. This was the most commonly used basic skill that every cultivator could learn and use, red flame slash. The fire broke into the sky, divided the light into two, and then cast away, just like a hot knife cutting butter, cut the unexpected beast into two halves along with the mountains behind it, the light converged, and by Chiron threw away the sword whose blade was burned by red flames into molten iron, and then hummed coldly, do you despise the Qi refining stage cultivators? I'm very strong. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.